Hello everyone, Tom here with some more Forward Escape the Fold because I'm really digging this game. Uh, I still haven't beat it. We're going to try this new character out. So what their ability does is this absorption. Absorbs three health points from all nearby enemies. So left, right, up, down, and diagonals. It's important to note that this thing does not work on enemies on the board. It's just ones that are next to you, right? Some some things work on everybody close, like the swords or everybody that you can see. This is not. It's not field of view. But we're still going to go with it. Because I haven't done a video with this character. Die, damn you, die. Suffer my ordeal. Oh, they're pleasant. All right. Um, we got health. I'm gonna try and avoid corrupted items, I think, on this run. That's my thinking, anyway. Okay, we just took a massive beating. <laughs> One thing I've learned is that I don't have to always go forward. You can actually go to the side. I don't know how I didn't try that before, but it's a life changer. We are getting beat up. But we can get, I'm going to get more stuff now. Now that I know I can do that, right? You do this. Do I do this? No, it's a net it's a net negative to do that. Look at this. We can go like this. Go like that. Go like that. And then like that. Like I didn't know you could do that. So if you didn't know you could do it, you're welcome. There's there's the tip of the day. You can actually go sideways on the board. I just assumed because of the name of the game was forward, you went forward every turn. Kiwi, when you receive blindness, you gain plus one mana point. Ooh, and powerless one. Powerless could be bad. But getting the mana makes it so that we're recharging this thing all the time. The bone bow, when an enemy dies without attacking or being attacked, you gain one skull. Ooh. We will be killing enemies with this thing. Reduces the cost of your power by one mana point. Ooh, that's good too. I think we're going to take this. I think we're going to take this thing. It's just guaranteed cheaper, right? Like it's going to be four now. You managed to escape from a disgusting monster by hiding behind a dead tree. Only now do you notice that on the ground at your feet is an object that might interest you. Vitality Dagger? The boss's loot will always be a healing potion card? I don't know if I want that. Because then that means that my health isn't gonna... My, my max health won't increase, right? That sounds like a bad play for me. I'm not gonna take it. Maybe, that, maybe I'm misunderstanding that card. But a healing potion versus increasing my max health, I'll take my max health every day, I think. I think. I think. I think. I think I will. Maybe that's a bad play. A uh, disgusting vial, an elderly woman appears on your way and offers you a drink. You inspect the disgusting vial and decide to refuse it politely. The woman in anger transforms herself into, a, into an abominable, I can barely ever say that word, creature and tells you death is the gift I offer you. I feel like I'm in such a better situation, though, knowing that I can go left and right. It's it's literally a game changer for me. So we're going to use our ability here. We can kill these guys. <laughs> right? Use. Boom. Look at all that money. Big stacks of cash. Like, that is so crazy. I didn't know I could do that. We're going to get so much more money, so much more healing, so much more mana. And maybe, maybe I'll be able to beat the game now because I figured that out. But we can use our thing again and that'll heal us up. Which also makes it so that we can actually kill these things pretty easily. Um. Yeah. 
I don't I won't bother with this guy. Um let's go here. Killing lots of things. We'll take the shields for sure. We don't really need oh we have 15 HP, okay. Hello, gorgeous. Let's go. Easy kill. Yeah, so like if this was a healing potion, I wouldn't be getting max health increase. Um, that sounds like way too much randomness for me. You get six turns with a positive or negative status every time you're hit. You receive immunity times three when starting a level. What is immunity? You can't have any other status effects as long as you have this one. Interesting. Carrot gives plus one healing potion and nerfs shield cards. I think I want this. I think I'm going to just take that thing. It means I can't have po be poisoned or anything at the start. As you advance across the barren plains, the monsters become more and more numerous. What better way to get back in shape than a good battle with a scorpion? Let's do this. We've got money. I can hit this guy. Is that the right time, though? It doesn't matter. Just use it. Yeah, it's a good time for it. Lovely. This is going to kill these dudes. Nice. That. That. We're full health. I don't need to worry about that. Um, let's do this one. Sword? I would love that mana potion. I don't want to get poisoned, though. I'm not willing to do that. I'm going to get poisoned. I'd rather get poisoned, I think, than fight through this entire line of dudes. We're well on our way. Just running straight up the middle. Ooh, look at this dragon. I don't know if I've ever seen that before. Heal up. Take that. This. Ooh, nice. That's good RNG right there. Get the money. Heal again. And another heart. The next enemy you attack will not inflict any damage. Like, I feel like those kind of things are nice. They kind of, like, taking these uh, smaller buffs kind of start to stack, right? It's a free That's a free fight. I replace all chest cards with golden chest cards. Book of Attack increases the chance that the enemy's loot is a sword card. Kind of like that. All right, let's go. Distant Smokes. The smoke you saw in the distance was, in fact, a thriving city full of curious dwellers. Who knows what you might find? We got ourselves a shop. Hmm. Healing Potion. Crimson Flower. This is a corrupted item, right? All Healing Potion cards removed... All your wait. All healing potion cards remove all your status effects, positive and negative. Man, that could be good. I rarely have a positive effect. It's almost always a negative. If I take this mana potion, we're going in with our ability right out of the gate. I'm just gonna take the mana potion. We're going to leave. Go to the forge. All poison cards also inflict one damage to all visible enemies. That's kind of nice. The heart cards give you seven armor durability, but do not... Uh, no, I'm not doing that. I think I'm going to take this thing. Tempted. Then it doesn't just hurt me, it hurts everybody else, right? Let's take that thing. Start with three shield on the next area. Also tempting. Do it. Leave. I don't think I need really anything else. I can't afford anything anyway. I was pretty I'm pretty happy with that. Strange hissing, terrifying hissing sound. Louder and louder. After a few seconds, it's a snake. 
It's a snake. So we have immunity. Look at the size of that dragon. We're taking it on right out of the gate. Let's do it. I could use my ability and nerf its health by three. It's not going to actually heal me, but it's going to hurt him. Let's do it. Take the money. Um, we'll take the shields. There we go. Take the mana potions. Merchant chest allows you to buy items. I don't really have money to buy anything with. Unfortunately, I just spent all my money. It's not a good time. I'm going to play it safe here. There's no need to take those fights. This will hurt them as well as me. Do I have any need to do... Well, I'm going to take it no matter what. There, it's easier for me to do this. Um. Ooh. If I go here, this is probably actually a better path for me. Not the most ideal path, but we got there. Shields. You don't need the healing. Take the money. Take the money. Um, we haven't killed many guys, have we? Our skulls are only that. Um, I'd like to kill this guy. And then get that shield up ahead. He's hitting for seven. Maybe it would, have, it would have been better to go there, but that's fine. We can skip that fight, actually. Um, Yeah, we don't need to fight him. Take the money. Kill this guy. Off we go. The Ethereal Sword. The next sword you card you pick up will do twice as much damage. Again, not bad, right? It's just it's only a one-use thing. Uh, when you receive skulls, you gain one mana point. So... When we kill someone, we gain mana? Oh man, I don't think I can pass it up. I don't think that I, I... If that's how that works, that's crazy. The smell of dung is appalling in this dungeon. As you move forward, you see the sleeping body of an impossibly large dog. I will crush you. <laughs> All right. Um, how do I want to play this? Straight up? Yeah, I think so. There. Get the mana going. This guy's going to try and poison me, which I don't appreciate. Let's do this. Um... Do that. Give us all that money. Hmm. Let's take this fight. He's gonna poison me too? I wonder for how much. Does it tell me? For uh, Times three, eh? That's what that means? Um... No. There we go. We got our thing. This might be moving up one more spot might be the play. Um, do we really want to use it when like here? No point. No, we'll just move up. We'll use it now. Yeah. And kill this guy. Get a skull out of the deal. Killed that guy behind. Got a skull. I guess I didn't even have to hit him. I didn't realize I was going to get the back row with that. This. This. All right. 
Greed ring. What's this? When you lose greed, your power becomes available? Ah, so it automatically fills up my power. That's kind of nice. If I'm reading that properly. Here we go again. This item cannot be sta stacked. When you lose greed, your power becomes available. It doesn't say that it locks it out. It just says it becomes available. You're hitting hard. Okay. Easily had enough health, though. We can't... We already have this, right? We just we just took this thing. Ease. Um, I don't know about that. Giving myself a random status effect for positive or negative. Plus one healing potions. And we nerf shields. It's just when you start a level, though. And I'm a... Wait, I'm immune to status effects when I start a level. Take the carrot. You enter a house where the smell of potions is intoxicating. A sorcerer offers you to taste his potions. Ooh, what's a scroll? Increases the chance of rare and legendary items appearing. Sounds good. We can get two of these things if it'll let me buy both. Uh, Increases the chance that enemies loot as a mana potion card. All heal healing potion cards are removed. Wait, remove all stats effects, positive and negative. We're going to take the scroll. Do we want this? Increase the chance of... Like, we already increased the chance of swords. I don't think I need to increase the chance of mana potions. Uh, it's been several dozen minutes that a jeweler with an improbable look tells you the, the benefits of her precious stones. You let yourself be seduced and decide to take a look at her stock. Ooh. Mana ring reduces the cost of your power by one mana point. Oh man, it would only cost us three. After being attacked by a boss, you gain as many gold points. I think we're taking this thing. We, uh, then we only need three mana points to, to get this going, which is crazy. A devilish presence. Your vision becomes blurred. A demonic presence is close by. You open your eyes wide and see a black shadow. Suddenly, it launches itself towards you. Um, I think we do the sword. Sword's gonna kill everything. If I do this, though, get the health off this thing. Um, I really want the money. But if I go that way to the right too far, I won't get my, I won't get the money. Just, yeah, let's just play this. Let's play it safe. Go here. Go sword again. Very well kill everything. And do that. That's powerless. That's fine. Oh, concerned about that. Stacking shields. Stacking health. I should have taken that gold. What was I thinking? Um... We're going to kind of play it safe right now. We're going to have to fight here twice. If I take this poison card, it's going to hurt everybody for one. No, we'll just do this. Not ideal, but we managed to squeeze through there. This guy hits for eight. If I go this way... And get my mana potion. I can pull health off of you. We are in bad shape all of a sudden. I don't want to get inflicted with uh, poison. Wow. Things just like all of a sudden went down. Take the poison. Oh no, we're so dead. can't even do that we're dead we're dead we're dead no we're so dead oh man 
It's going to be a personal best, though, for that character. It's my second best run I've ever had in the game. We will beat this thing. I swear it. Guys, thank you so much for watching. This was more Forward Escape the Fold. Be sure to subscribe to the channel if you want to see more of this game. That was our first video with this character. Um, very cool character. I'm just still learning the game. I've probably done like maybe four runs, five runs in this game. Uh, again, thank you so much for watching the video. Make sure to uh, like the video, subscribe, and I will catch you on the next one. Have a fantastic day.